Good evening everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Elizabeth. My channel name is Shy Town Girl and this is Miss Kalua still sleeping. Can you believe it? What a lazy dog. Okay, so I said good morning to you today. I said good afternoon today. Now I'm saying good evening and I am finishing up the rest of this Dollar Tree haul. So I am just going to dive right into it. All right, here we go. Came across some Easter bags. These are by Wala. And you get two in a package for one dollar. These are eight by ten and a half. I absolutely thought this was just a perfect pattern to use for some type of a gift, maybe an Easter gift for somebody a little bit older that you don't feel like a basket is quite appropriate. It comes with two bags. So the first bag is this design. And the second bag is this Little Bunnies with Easter Eggs. Now the handles are also colored rope as well. I can't really say, <laughs> I mean really, two bags for a buck, that is one heck of a deal. Alrighty, moving on. I found this other bag. I'm not even sure what I'm going to do with it. I just thought it was so pretty. And this is basically the type of bag that you would use to put like a bottle of wine or some type of alcohol. And it just said good times. But what I think I liked about it the most was there is so much glitter on here. And then they even took the time as they used the pink label to make the little pink um, heart heart the little pink star to match and that way you can write something on the back of there say you're going out with some of your girlfriends or you're going to someone's house for game night or something and you want to bring something just a little cute i say it all the time presentation is everything you could bring a bottle of wine and it's a bottle of wine put that bottle of wine with some tissue paper in a bag makes it all pop Staying with Voila, I thought this was adorable and I so wish they had more because I definitely would have grabbed them. You don't get as many sheets as you would in the big package, but this is a set of eight sheets of tissue paper. And when you see the design, you'll know why I grabbed it. There's those unicorns and they're even flying unicorns in pink and in purple. The other sheet is white. Of course, when you get these smaller packages like this with the decorations, you do lack how many pieces that you get. But you know what? Even if it's just four sheets of unicorns, I am totally okay with that. Alrighty, I think that's pretty much it for wrapping stuff. I did end up picking up, and these things, let me warn you, they make a mess. If you end up buying them, ask them to bag them separately because no matter what you have in your bag, is gonna end up everywhere. These are the onion grass. This one is done in purple and I absolutely love it. See all that sparkle that you're getting? Now these are smushed up, so usually when I get them, I'll start to fan them out because like you see how this one's like all grouped together? You do have to kind of pull them apart but do it gently because they are very fragile. But once you start opening the stems up, you'll see just how wide this becomes and how you can branch it in different directions. So I ended getting two in the purple and they only had one pink and that was all they had. They were completely wiped out. I'm gonna try to get a few of the Easter eggs that has the long grass with it to make some type of an arrangement for my Easter table. I then had to pick up something for Miss Kalua because she has been such an awesome awesome amazing dog through my entire everything that's been going on she has not left my side at all so i did pick her up one of the uh rawhide retriever rolls this is they say six inches i don't think this is six inches i could be wrong oh no it's six inches hmm. i guess six inches doesn't look like what it used to look like Anyways, I did get her one chew bone because when she's a good girl, she gets one of her rawhides. And yes, when I give her a rawhide, I watch her. She doesn't eat them home alone. I make sure that I focus on what she is chewing because I know sometimes that dogs can have problems. So I do make sure I keep a good eye on her. Okay, let's move to just a couple household things. I needed to purchase a couple more lighters and these are the crock lighters. I have talked about these for 
so, well, actually probably about two years now I've been talking about these. What's really great about these is you have your regular size lighter and then you have your longer lighters. What's perfect about this is just, it's the perfect length for lighting just regular candles throughout your house. You don't wanna use a regular like Bic or Scripto lighter because you end up burning your finger. Why use one of those gargantuan ones that you light your barbecue with? This is the absolute perfect size. You'll usually find them either down the automotive section. Sometimes you can find them by the checkouts. They come in all different colors. They are definitely worth the dollar. I cannot speak highly enough about them. I've been using them for a long time. This was something completely new in my area in the household section. Now, for those of you that own washers and dryers, and you, some people call them slop sinks, some people call them drain sinks, but the sink that sits next to your washing machine where you have the hose that runs out your water, dirty water from your laundry. What I do is I put a screen on the end of the hose so when all that dirty stuff is flowing out, you'd be amazed at how much lint gets caught in the trap. So I usually go to like Lowe's or Walmart and for two trap holders that you put on, it's usually anywhere from $4 to $6 for a package. Well, guess what? They have them at the Dollar Tree. So if you're not sure exactly what I'm speaking of, these are made by Durist. You just open one up and maybe you get a better concept. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to get a zip tie. And then you're going to get this little wire mesh. You're going to roll this wire mesh down. And there you have it. You are then, it's almost like putting a condom on. Oh, my bad. You're going to take the tube, the rubber tube that runs into that faucet. You're going to slip this up over the tube. You're then going to attach your clip. And then all that crappy stuff that flows out of your washing machine that you have no idea is going down into your drains gets all caught up in here. And then all the lint, once it fills up, pop it off, throw it in the garbage. You really save a lot on your drain system. And if you're in a real bind and you don't want to spend the money for that, take a knee-high stocking. It does the same thing. Just trim it, bring it up the hose, put on any kind of zip tie, does the same thing. Check it out. You won't believe how much stuff comes out of your washing machine. Okay, that's enough preaching about that. We have a few sweets. I ended up getting a couple more packages of the Russell Stover's. You get four filled marshmallow eggs. Who doesn't love Russell Stover's? I do. I know my friend Linda does. <laughs> I know lots of people that do. But these are flying off the shelves because they're just not going to make it to Easter. So if you're looking for something to fill up Easter baskets with, these are the bomb and so worth it. You do get four to package. Your package total weight is 2.25 ounces. Not a bad deal. The next item. I buy a lot of bubble gum because I like to blow my bubbles. This time, I, I, haven't, I see a lot of double bubble, but I never saw one in this variety. This is the three fantastic flavors, grape, apple, and watermelon. Absolutely love them all. I thought, what a perfect bag of gum for me. They're all individually wrapped in a four ounce package, and there you go. Love them. Throw a couple in my purse, and away I go. Okay repeat purchase my bad you know those musketeers i bought the ones that said uh happy birthday the birthday cake ones inside well i snarfed them they're all gone my bad so i had to replace it with another one if you haven't seen these at your store these are the three musketeer birthday cake minis and they are so good it's a 2.26 ounce package i piggied out i was a bad bad girl bad girl all right, one more candy item. These were totally new, and they even say new on the package. These are made by Tootsie Roll, and who doesn't love Tootsie Rolls? It says new, individually wrapped, candy-coated, egg-shaped Tootsie Rolls. You get 3.5 ounces in a package. This is what the bag looks like. Now, Tootsie Rolls in general are fat-free, but obviously there's going to be candy on these, so they won't be so fat-free anymore. Let's check them out. I like the fact that they're individually wrapped. This one happens to be blue. I was gonna try and see, oh, I can, it's so soft. 
I can actually pull it apart. There is your Tootsie Roll. My bad again. There's another flavor. It almost tastes like, yes, it's a Tootsie Roll, but when you're licking the Tootsie Roll Pops and you bite into it before you should, so you get some candy and Tootsie Roll, that's exactly what it tastes like. I only purchased one bag because I really, really wasn't sure. But after giving one a try, yummy. Okay, what else? Oh, have you guys seen the new keychains out and about? There's always several keychains out and about. But have you seen these ones? Oh gosh, they're so cute. They measure, well, if we're going to measure just the pom-pom, it's about three and a half inches. So from the top of the keychain to the bottom is about five inches. Me, myself, I don't like this white clip, so I would definitely replace it, but how adorable is that? And it basically just says pom-pom clip. Now, I have a couple of them here, and... I really didn't see too much of a difference. So for the most part, half pink, half yellow. Um, I didn't see any other tops that were different. They're simply precious. So I was very happy to score a couple of those. And then what was sitting right next to those? Here comes Mr. Flamingo. There's Mr. Flamingo. Look at his little foots. <laughs> Isn't that adorable? So here's your flamingo. It has a pink little puff, and then I'll bring it in close. There's the flamingo's eyes. And if you're seeing me bouncing back and forth, it's because Kalu is pushing against me. I, she must have an itch. And then look at the little feet. Simply adorable. This pom-pom's a little bit smaller. This one's about two and a half inches. From height top to bottom to the bottom of his little footsies is eight inches. Simply adorable adorable i thought i mean once you get rid of the tag and then i would also trim this tag off as well once you get rid of all that kind of stuff it's simply <laughs> i just think they're so adorable and i was able to get my hands on a couple so i was very pleased okay last but not least and this will actually complete the dollar haul that i've done three times today i found these bunnies when I first saw them, I was like, mm, they're going to be kind of cheesy. But then I took one apart and said, nope, I got to have one. So in the store, they have pink. They have yellow. And they have blue. I took it upon myself to take one apart because when you buy it in the store, it's going to have these tags on here. So if you go up to the checkout and they try to take it apart, tell them Beth says no. It's one piece. And there's the scan bar. It's two pieces. So I took one out of the package and I put it together and it's super simple. So here's your two pieces. They snap right together. Make sure you hear them click. What I thought was really cool about this is on the bottom, it's got these two little like um, plastic foots, we'll call them footies, that allows it to stand up. So I thought, let's open the blue one real quick here. Let me just take the tags off. How cute, number one, decoration purpose, you could fill this up with candy and give it to somebody. I have a little DIY in mind. I'm gonna hope I have time to finish it or at least start working on it. So there is your blue bunny. Isn't that adorable? And it's a durable plastic. There's the back side. So you could technically fill it up with sweets and give it to somebody. So we have the blue. And of course, I'm not gonna be able to get it back together. So we have, <laughs> we're gonna keep this real and I am not editing. I really don't edit my videos because uh, you know, it is. I'm human. I make mistakes. I, I say words incorrectly. Um, it is what it is. So there's the blue bunny. These are pretty decent sized. 
These measure from the top of the ears. Wow, these are pretty big. From the top of the, if I learn to hold my ruler, from the top of the bunny's ear all the way down is 10 inches. That is adorable. So you have your boy bunny, your girl bunny, or you can do any colors you want. I thought these were just great decorative purposes, and that is what I solely plan on using them for. All right, everybody, I cannot believe I finally finished my Dollar Tree haul. Miss Kalua, can you come over here and say hi to everybody? Come over here. Can you sit, please? Sit. Can you sit for mommy? Sit. That's a good girl. Can you see everybody up here? Looky, mommy. Look at mommy's camera. Look at. No, 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 mommy's camera. See? Say hi, everybody. Can you sit, please? Kalua, sit. Good girl. Say hi. So you can give me paw. Oh, thank you so much. Can I have this paw over here? Oh, thank you so much. You say hi to everybody. Hi, everybody. Can you give mommy a kiss? Oh, I love you too. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Any questions or comments, please hit us up down below. Have a wonderful evening. Bye, everyone.